How's it going everybody? Welcome back to the Empton Motor YouTube channel. Today I'm going to get a nasty bubble. How's it going everybody? Welcome back to the M2 Motoring YouTube channel. Thank you for tuning in. As you can tell right now, I'm driving. Uh, on my way to pick up the wheels over at the powder coaters. And I'm really excited to see what they look like finished. I believe they will look pretty good. Um, it'll flow with the car. And thank you again everybody for your comments and suggestions and feedback on what color I should powder coat them after a lot of debating and deliberation and going back and forth with a few people and your comments I weighed it all out and made a decision on what color to powder coat the wheels and you're gonna see in this episode real soon so yeah just go ahead and kick back relax enjoy the video if you haven't already please go ahead and do me a favor smash that like button uh, leave a comment down below on some of the content you like to see with the car or any other projects we're working on or and if you haven't already please go ahead and subscribe but go ahead and relax and i'll be right back made it over here to kaiju motorsports with the new wheel setup they're getting everything prepped and ready and here's the new newly finished wheels along with a matte gunmetal or a charcoal Color, nice and clean for the car. Those are the new tires. That's who's installing it today. Go ahead and enjoy the video. Finally back home. Here's the wheels just stacked in front of the Mercedes. And there is the intercooler piping that was powder coated to match the wheels. Thanks again to Brian from Kaiju Motorsports and his crew for doing the mountain balancing for me. There is the TC. I apologize on the garage being a mess. Before I put the wheels back on the car, there are a few more steps that I need to complete with the car. So it's ready to come back on the ground. So I went ahead and put the wheels on the car and brought the car down and torqued the wheels down. Forgot to film all that. I was really excited to get it done. So there it is. I apologize on it being kind of dark. It is nighttime right now and I'm just finished up. So it's a nice clean look, you know, red car with gunmetal wheels. 
If you remember, Ken Gushi's original livery was a uh, RSR colored livery with white and red, and he had silver RPF ones. So this is, uh, you know, a little bit of a different take on it, I guess. But I like how it looks. It's nice. It's a nice clean look. I have a couple of things left to do on the car. Obviously, getting the engine management and tune done. That I'm waiting for uh, my friend's shop to get their new dyno in, and this will actually be the car that they're going to be tuning with. Obviously, take it to the body shop, get the hood repaired and repainted, the roof, and also the rear wing. In the meantime, I do have to take the rear wing mounts off and repaint them because they're really faded along with the APR mirrors. I also have to finish fixing the, uh, figuring out what's wrong with the audio setup and why it does not turn on. Should not be too hard to figure out, so hopefully I'll get that done real quick. Uh, and that, the car is pretty much close to being done. I mean, everything that I physically am doing is pretty much there. So, really excited to have this thing done and do some, you know, nice photos and everything and make, making sure this car is as close to 100% as I can possibly get it. Thank you again for following along with the journey of this project. I definitely do appreciate it. If you haven't already, please go ahead, hit that like button. And if you haven't already, please subscribe and leave some comments down below on what projects you want to see next in future videos. I have some more cool stuff coming in for the SLK, which is back there. And this car, my Daily XB, kind of not 100% sure what, whether I want to mess with another XB or just leave it alone or, you know, do some small stuff as you've already seen. There's some damage on the front lip and the rear bumper, so got to get that fixed. So, you know, changing something, maybe upgrade. I don't know. We'll see. But thanks again for tuning in. Definitely do appreciate it and take care.